life well lived. In 1923, a haircut from a young barber named Anthony Mancinelli would cost you a quarter. By the time he gave his last trim just a few weeks ago, Anthony was getting 19 bucks a head and even bigger tips for a seat with a legend. Mancinelli was born near Naples, Italy and sailed to America as an immigrant when he was eight years old. He settled in Newburgh, New York, where he swept floors at a local barber shop. At 12 years old, Mancinelli started cutting hair to make money to help his family. He later dropped out of high school to make it a full-time profession that would last nearly a century. In 1930, he hung out his own shingle, opening Anthony's Barber Shop. The only break Mancinelli ever took from cutting hair was to join the United States Army during World War II. Anthony was a barber for an astounding 96 years. He never retired and never had to wear glasses a day in his life. The Guinness Book of World Records declared Mancinelli the world's oldest practicing barber. He also was inducted into the Barber Museum Hall of Fame. Right up until his last haircut, Mancinelli was working an eight-hour shift five days a week, telling a local TV station, I don't get tired, I just keep going. Anthony was married to his wife Carmela for 69 years before she passed away 15 years ago. Anthony Mancinelli, immigrant, World War II veteran, and the world's oldest barber, died last week at home in New Windsor, New York. He was 108 years old.